And we've learned over the last couple of months, Joe Biden is a corrupt politician. He's a corrupt politician. And the Biden family is a criminal enterprise. Frankly, it makes crooked Hillary Clinton look like an amateur. Now, who ever saw anything like this? He goes to China, the kid is followed like a vacuum cleaner. He follows and follows and follows. And unfortunately, it sounds like he left his laptop behind, or they have thousands. Here's a guy didn't have a job, and now he's taking in millions, and plenty of it goes to Joe Biden, too. Don't kid yourself. It goes to Joe Biden. Did you see the one today? The guy gets 10 percent. 10 percent. I wonder who the guy is. This was not a good — between Anthony Weiner's laptop and this laptop, these are two beauties. I think this one could be worse than the Weiner laptop. Yet this massive scandal is being covered up by the media and big tech, right? All those people. Look at them. So we'll, here we have — think of it. Here we have the biggest scandal going on anywhere in the world, the corruption of Joe Biden and the Biden family. And he's interviewed last night by Stephanopoulos on ABC, and they don't even ask him the question about it. No, no, think of it. They don't even ask him a question like, you know, like, how come your son got three and a half million dollars from Moscow, right? From Moscow. Russia! Because they were the ones involved with Russia, it turns out. Not me. It was the opposite. But why did your son get three and a half million from the wife of the mayor of Moscow? Think of it. Think of it. A little question like that. Remember, Chris Wallace said, oh, well, you shouldn't ask him that question. Why now? Why is that, Chris? Tell me. He's no Mike. He's no Mike. Chris is no Mike. But then the other one. How about this? A billion dollars. Get rid of the prosecutor. Otherwise, you don't get the billion dollars from the United States. But that's turning out to be peanuts compared to what we're finding now. Now he wants $10 million from China to make an introduction. Would anybody here take $10 million to introduce somebody to your father? I'd do it. Dad, I'd do it for $10 million. bucks. I'd love to introduce. I would do it, Pop, and he'd want me to do it. $10 million, Dad, please. Ah, oh, I had a great father. I'm not just running against Biden and that corrupt family. I'm running against the left-wing corrupt media, and we're running against big tech. telling you that Biden family and others, but that Biden family is corrupt. It's a corrupt family. And with me and my kids, let me tell you, my kids, I'll tell you something, though, it is very to lock them up. You shouldn't lock them up. Lock up the Bidens. Lock up Hillary. Lock them up. Can you imagine if my kids did what this guy Hunter is doing? Ivanka. Oh, my beautiful, my wonderful Ivanka. She's an innocent. She's a good kid. Can you imagine? And you know, she's much smarter, much sharper. She could, if she wanted to, how could she do well? And Don and Eric and Tiffany. They're just, they're good kids. But you know, we don't do things. We don't, it's like, boy, they'd make a fortune. Just think of it. And when you look at what they get away with — and by the way, Biden's brother, try that one. I won't go too deep in the family. I'm not looking to insult everybody. But honestly, in my opinion, it's a criminal enterprise. It's a criminal enterprise. He's like a vacuum cleaner. The, the father goes through and the son comes in a vacuum cleaner, millions of dollars for him. And take a look at the way they live. Forty-seven years he's a politician. He lives very well.